In our previous videos, we successfully built and programmed the Altair 8800 computer using its front panel switches. You might wonder, why would anyone choose to program this computer? It seems so challenging. Indeed, programming these switches can be cumbersome. Fortunately, there is a way to connect a keyboard and a monitor to this computer. Historically, computers like the Altair 8800 could be linked to input and output devices using a serial board. The serial board served as an interface between the computer and external devices such as a terminal, enabling data entry and output to a display device. The process works as follows. The CPU is programmed to send data to a specific output device, in this case the serial board. The board then converts this data into serial form, transmitting it bit by bit over a serial cable. This board is responsible for generating control bits, such as a start and stop bit, and parity bits for error correction. Incoming data from external devices is similarly processed by the board before being relayed to the CPU. I've acquired an 882SAO JP board, a serial board designed for the S100 bus system used by the Altair 8800. It's an enhanced version of the original MITS 882SAO serial board developed in 1976. Despite its complex appearance, filled with numerous components, uh, the board is quite straightforward. This specific board has additional functionality, which is not required, but we will go ahead and implement it as well to have a fully finished board. Let's go ahead and get started with soldering the components. In the next video, we'll install this board into the computer and set up connections to a keyboard and a display. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. We've got a lineup of interesting videos coming your way and we don't want you to miss out.